But anytime you see smoke when it's hot and dry like this, you got to be on your toes. A tuft of smoke billowing in the distance was all it took for Tim Seifert to phone a friend. I said, Sam, I think, I think we got a problem up here, and he was on his way. Sam Snell's farm was burning. Acres and acres of hard work willowing to the dry ashy ground. He had harvested about three days ago. He probably maybe 25 acres of corn, standing corn. But more than 100 acres of land. A smoky battlefield for seven area fire departments and more than a dozen other farmers, neighbors and friends. There was farmers coming from as far as Loami and that they, they heard about it and they seen the smoke and they told them to get their discs out because this thing's moving, it's moving fast. Because the land was so dry and the wind so fierce, fire officials say it took three hours to calm the hungry blaze, a process that would have been longer had it not been for a few good friends. We actually took and uh, dumped corn on the fire to try to smother it out. He's overwhelmed by the neighbors. I mean, uh, Sam's a tremendous, a tremendous neighbor himself. I guarantee if something was going on with my farm or any of the guys that was there to help him today, Sam would be the first one there.